There is a bill on Governor Newsom's desk right now that would change how your food delivery bill looks. We're talking about third party delivery apps like Grubhub, Uber Eats or DoorDash. Fox 5's Ashley Jacobs is live for us in Kearney Mesa this afternoon with what this effort by a local assembly member is all about. Ashley. Andrew, good afternoon to you. As you mentioned, this bill has passed the Assembly and the Senate and is now on Governor Newsom's desk. He has 30 days to sign it into law. San Diego's Lorena Gonzalez wrote Assembly Bill 286. Once law, it will require food delivery companies to provide both customers and restaurants itemized cost breakdowns. DoorDash got caught stealing drivers' tips um, last year and, and fined in California. And we just want to make sure it's very clear that when an individual gives a tip, that the driver receives that on top of any other pay that they're owed. Like many, Gonzalez utilized food delivery apps like DoorDash, Uber Eats, and Grub. Hub during the height of the pandemic, not knowing the huge fees mom and pop restaurants were forking out. It was convenient, nice, but we also didn't know how much the restaurants were paying and sometimes up to 30%. And so I think for our favorite restaurant, are we really worried about them getting back on their feet? Knowing that they're paying that much may convince us to go in person or pick it up. The bill passes the Senate and Assembly as consumer, restaurant, and government pushback against those third party platforms grows. San Diegans we spoke with support AB 286 for several reasons. I think it's a great opportunity for people in that industry to like really know what they're earning. At the end of the day, the drivers deserve what they work for rather than certain companies. I feel like it's good for them to like know how much the driver's getting and how much the like the business is getting. It gives us transparency of kind of where all our money's going. And that's what it's all about in simple terms. Assemblywoman Gonzalez says AB 286 will give customers and small business owners peace of mind when it comes to each dollar spent. I think that's only fair as, as consumers, um, whether we're buying a house, a car, whether you know you're getting taxed on a, a receipt, you like to know, oh, this much is taxed and that's going to the government. This much goes to the store. This is just an extension of those types of purchases. Now, one woman we spoke with off camera said as soon as she found out how much those delivery apps were taking from restaurants, she actually stopped using the apps because of that reason. We did reach out to several, including DoorDash, Grubhub, and uh, what was the third one? Postmates is who else we reached out to, and no one got back to us, Andrew. So we are still waiting to hear from them. For now, though, we are live in Kearney Mesa. Ashley Jacobs, Fox 5 News. All right, Ashley, thank you for that.